Try to take after Michael Pittman like he did last year. Just be aggressive and get them off the ball, give them a little shove, and then just take no prison. Stanford's rolling on up. On second and eight, a shot towards the end zone. Touchdown, Parkinson. 19 yards. Costello has time, looks for the end zone, jump ball, deflected, caught, touchdown, Parkinson. And they did it with Colby Parkinson, Chad. Yeah, four touchdowns on the night, but the individual matchups, I mean, he was able to create mismatches due to his 6'7 size, whether it's an outside linebacker from the Beavers, a 5'9 DB, ran past, jumped over, and just outlinked the Beaver defenders all night long. It was an impressive performance by him. This is kind of right on track for what we had uh, hoped for him, which was um, we had a you know decision last year whether or not to redshirt him because we knew we needed to get stronger to play tight end. But he's got such great ball skills. Um, we had to play him as a friend. And I don't know how many touchdowns he caught last year. He's a big-time red zone threat last year. For us, it was about getting him to be effective early on, really develop and have more opportunities this year, which he's taken advantage of. And, and you know, next year I anticipate him being um, kind of where Caden is, which is one of, if not the best tight end in America. Play action, Mills lost it for Colby Parkinson. Mm. And unfortunately, Oregon State has seen that before. Tough to do anything about it. Parkinson, one-on-one, -on -one, makes the call, mouse in the house. Pressure coming. Mills to Colby Parkinson, breaks a tackle into Oregon State territory. And Colby Parkinson, a huge play. Away with that, college. <laughs> Different game now. The pitch to Scarlett, flips it, Parkinson is throwing to Davis Mills, and he makes a tremendous catch, touchdown Stanford.